It is simple to see how well cows are doing by monitoring the amount of milk they produce and tracking milk component percentages. But milk weights and component percentages on their own do not accurately allow dairy farmers to assess efficiency, profitability, or how to make economically based management decisions. This is where Energy Corrected Milk, or ECM, comes in to improve decision making on farms and put all cows on an equal basis for comparative purposes in the herd over time. ECM determines the amount of milk produced and adjusts the milk to 3.5% fat and 3.2% protein. As an example, farmer Joe Smith wants to know more about how his 500 cows are producing milk each month. He knows what his milk weight and components were last month, but this month they are different. Using the ECM equation, Joe Smith can equalize his production values over the two-month time period in order to evaluate performance with changes in feed, management, or cow environment during that time. In Joe's case, the equation for last month's production looks like this. To compare to this month's values of 90 pounds of milk, 3.3% butterfat, and 3.1% protein, simply calculate ECM for those production results. Without calculating ECM, Joe Smith might have thought his milk production increased by 5 pounds for that month, when it only increased by 1.2 pounds of milk. ECM is important because 1. Milk fat concentration is most sensitive to dietary changes and can vary in a range of over 3 percentage units. And 2. Dietary changes can result in milk protein concentration changing approximately 0.6 percentage units. Knowing the ECM value over time helps Joe determine feed ingredient response and optimize strategies like the cow's environment, cow comfort, genetics, and transition cow health. This is what improves efficiency and ultimately, profitability. <laughs>